Hello, welcome to my channel. Let's talk today about Axis camera on Roku TV. As you can see, I have my camera up and running here and I'm using this software, the IP Camera Viewer Pro. Okay, you can also use the basic version that allows one camera. I have more than one camera in this uh, TV. That's the reason I'm using the Pro version, right? But it's pretty simple. You just need to use this IP Camera Viewer Pro and you can come here and add a new camera. And then you're going to insert all the information, camera name, description, IP, TCP port, login, password, okay? And also you need to come here and select the camera brand. As you can see, I'm using Axis, okay? So let me just come back to the main menu here. I already have my Axis running. It's a P1365 Mark II. So let me just show the information that I have for this camera. Basically, I have the camera name, description, the IP. Remember that I have this camera in the same router as my TV, so my TV can find the camera on the network. TCP ports 80 is the standard one. And logging, standard logging for Axis camera is root and the password. I just create a password there in the camera and then I can use it here. And uh, instead of using the OnViv protocol, I'm using the direct integration with Axis camera. When I come to this button and I hit next, the first one is Axis Companion, but if you go to Previews, you find the Axis, the regular protocol, okay? And the stream URL, you don't need to touch. That's the one that works. You come to this test camera config, click on it, and you see that camera is working. And then you just hit save the camera, and you're gonna see that the camera is working, okay? It takes a while, it loads, and it's there. And then you can have the camera on full screen and it also works with different cameras, right? Because this software can handle different cameras. If you go to split view, for example, you can have more than one camera here live, okay? So it's basically working with Axis camera and that's the way you can do it. If you have Axis camera, it's pretty simple. It uses the native Axis protocol, okay? So that's all for today. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel, leave your thumbs up and your comments. See you in the next video.